So I just randomly thought, <laughs> maybe I should do this video since I'm heating up my leftovers, but uh, would you guys like to see that? <laughs> hey, hey, how are you? Um, it's the day after, ah! <laughs> it's the day after Thanksgiving, and um, no, that's, that's not true. <laughs> that's an absolute lie straight from the pit of hell. It is two days after Thanksgiving, it is Saturday, and I have my leftovers out here. I'm going to show you those in just a second, but let me get a plate really quick. And I thought, you know what? Like, it's a Saturday evening. I'm getting ready to go get a fountain pop with... You want to see all the see all of our exciting plates. It is um, a Saturday. <laughs> There's all of our exciting plates. Oh, hey, hold on a second. You want to see all of my Starbucks cups up there? Oh, my Lord, look at all that and the mugs and everything. Anyway... It is a Saturday night, and I'm getting ready to go get um, a fountain <laughs> Oh my lord. Not that, not that. I'm getting ready to go get a fountain pop. This is kind of like a vlog, really, but... Oh, did I even get a plate? I did. I'm getting ready to go get a fountain pop with my good Judy, Tanya Jean. And um, she's finishing up some work, and she said, what are you doing? And I was like, well, I'm making some videos. So I was like, uh, let me eat something real quick and heat something up, and then I will uh, come pick you up for a fountain pop. So we're gonna go do that, I'm real excited about that. But I wanted to show you what I'm having. Now, my husband and I, we each got different leftovers because his leftovers have turkey in them. Mine do not. So the first thing, and I will show you, here I'll show you and then I'll show you each little thing. Here are the rolls from Taylor's Bakery, leftover. And then here's the stuffing that I made. This is my vegetarian stuffing that did not work out very well. There you go. And then this was the leftovers. Alex got mashed potatoes from Costco that I have to tell you were like the best mashed potatoes in the entire world. Here's some of my stuffing and then here's mac and cheese from Costco, which was like the best mac and cheese in the entire world. So basically, we had Thanksgiving. Well, uh, not all of it. So if at my uh, mother-in-law's house, it was like five people at each place. At my mother-in-law's house, um, we brought mashed potatoes, stuffing, and macaroni and cheese. She made turkey, and then she made me my own corn salad that was vegetarian. And then she also made like this green bean casserole that was vegetarian. And then she also made um, uh, French bread. I was talking about this actually in my vlog last night. I don't know if I have any. Do I have any um, left in the refrigerator? Well, if I do, no, I don't think I do. Um, of the French bread I was going to show you guys. And then, of course, I have my pure water right here. I love this thing. This was one of the best things I purchased in 2020. Fill it up. Although, you have to, like, if you haven't seen this, you have to, like, fill the water through this. Here, I'll show you. So, you, you do this, right? And then you fill the water through it. Oh, my gosh, my hand is shaking so much from holding it with one hand. So, you fill it all the way. Oh, my hand, I'm sorry that the camera is shaking. By the way, this right here, this Everspring hand um, soap that you can get, this is... Uh, winter citrus and pine. You can get it at Target. It is the best smelling soap. This is one of my new Starbucks mugs. My Arizona Starbucks. This is just water that I've been drinking today. And this is my new Christmas mug. But anyway, that's what you do. It takes forever to fill this up, though. So, at my mother-in-law, she made all of that. And then, what else did she make? Oh, she made Trace Leche's cake. And then she had a pumpkin pie. And then I took cookies to the kids, which they loved. Then at my cousin Caroline's, um, her husband does all of the cooking, and he is a fantastic cook. He made turkey. So, like, at my mother-in-law's, like, they do things different. I mean, you don't celebrate Thanksgiving in, in Venezuela, where they're from. So, she does, like, pieces of turkey, and then she kind of, like, sautés it and stuff. Now, I'm a vegetarian, so I don't eat turkey, but my husband did. He loves her turkey. So, at my uh, cousin's house, it was just five of us as well, like, her husband, uh, at five... Five or six of us. How many was it? It doesn't matter. But anyway, um, so her husband did a turkey, you know, the whole thing, carved the turkey and everything. Then he made homemade stuffing, uh, but it was chicken um, stock, so I couldn't have it. And then he made mashed potatoes, which were fantastic. Um, deviled eggs, which were fantastic. He makes the best. My mom made good deviled eggs. Mike, my cousin's husband, he makes like, oh God, I should have, we didn't bring any food home from Caroline's house because we already had all this. And I'm really mad because I really want some pumpkin pie. I want some pumpkin pie. Okay. So let me get a fork out. Do you want to hear something funny about me? Okay. Ever since I was a little kid, 
I always, if, if given the option when to eat, I always pick the small, the salad fork. Is that so funny? Okay. We also have two kinds of silverware in here. This was our old silverware back in the day. It has like red and white, and then there's, I guess it's kind of Christmas silverware and green. But um, then we got this silverware. I think we got this as just like flatware, nice flatware. I think we got it at like Craig and Barrel, maybe? Anyway, who cares, right? Who cares, right, Tucker? Tucker's right down there. So, um, let's put some macaroni and cheese on here. I should be showing it, shouldn't I? But I can't really show it while I'm... <laughs> I can't really show it while I'm <laughs> scooping it. What can I put you on? Here, I'm going to put you on. Can you see? Okay, so... I'm going to... This is my container of the vegetarian stuff that I can have. So I'm gonna put some mac and cheese on here. So hungry, I haven't eaten today. And then these fantastic mashed potatoes from Costco. Clean up as you go. And then my fantastic stuffing that my, it's just like, look, it's so, <laughs> well, I had a little bit of an accident. You can go watch my vlog, but my stuffing didn't really hold together very well with the vegetable stock, but it's okay. So, mmm, delicious. Now, we got a new microwave. This is our brand new microwave that we purchased. What do you think? It's very, very fancy. Put my plate on there. We got a big one suit. Now, all kinds of stuff we can put in here. And I'm gonna put it for one, start. It has a little song that it plays at the end, which I absolutely love. So anyway, then my cousin's husband, he also made apple cobbler, which I wish I would have brought some of that home. And he also, um, they had a pumpkin pie from, what is going on here with the, Come on, focus. Then he, um, they also had a pumpkin pie from Taylor's Bakery, and I had a piece of that. I had a piece of pumpkin pie, which was delicious, and I had a piece of apple cobbler with vanilla ice cream, and it was so good! Oh my god, it was so good. But you know what? Like, aren't leftovers so much better, like, the day or two later? I have to tell you, which is something so funny, that I, first of all, am, am a vegetarian, so I haven't had turkey in a while, but I used to hate Miracle Whip, okay? Except, and I don't know where this started, when um, around Thanksgiving, I must have been at somebody's house or something, and I also will not eat a sandwich unless the bread is toasted. I like, I have to have my bread toasted, even if it's just a peanut butter sandwich. And I don't eat peanut butter and jelly. I actually, it's right here behind you. I eat this organic raw honey. But anyway, um, and I haven't even used that forever. So anyway, um, this vegetarian honey or whatever it's called. But anyway, anyway, <laughs> I got so hooked on, I was like, I would love to have like the turkey turkey, you know, like not like the, the thin pieces of turkey that you get in the deli, but like pieces of turkey, like, you know, um, after Thanksgiving and then on white bread, like just plain white bread that's sitting out, not toasted. I, oh, I also, well, I have to get my food to see if it's ready. Oh! look at this doesn't that look so good okay but um then i like well here close that that's not the song that it usually plays it plays a longer song than that but anyway um i loved a turkey sandwich on white bread with miracle whip i don't even know where that started but i was like and it had to be like bread that because i like to keep my bread in the refrigerator so it's kind of like a little bit more firm but anyway so here is my leftovers let's try them let's see if they're Do we have any salt and pepper? We have pepper, but I don't think we have any salt. Yeah, we have black pepper right here. I don't think I need any black pepper on this, but I... Anyway, this does not look so good. So anyway, happy Thanksgiving. Mm, maybe another 45 seconds. There is nothing like getting a new microwave, is there? Oh my God, I love it. <laughs> I absolutely love it. Oh my gosh, my roll. And I still have some stuffing left over. I think that was my husband's uh, secret area. <laughs> secret, secret, um, what do you call it? Secret stuffing, but <laughs> oh well. 
I almost blew up the kitchen. Did you guys hear about this? Okay, so if you watch my vlog, you know this. But I was, um, had butter on the stove and I like ran in the other room. I literally just turned on the stove too. I had butter in the, on the stove and I ran in the other room to check to make sure that my vlog was uploading. And, um, I don't know why I'm picking like the best roll or whatever. Here's the rolls. I love it. So anyway, I uh, put the butter on the stove, and I ran in the other room. It, I'm laughing, but it was really scary. Excuse me. And I took the, my cousin's husband was like, did you not know to put, you don't put cold water on 150 degree butter? And I said, yeah, I know that I wasn't thinking. So anyway, I ran, I took the pot over into the sink, threw on the water onto the hot, because it was like, I sounded like it was cracking the pan. And so I turned the ice water, this is 5.30 in the morning going into Thanksgiving, you guys, okay? I was not prepared for the day whatsoever. I had to wash my jeans and upload my vlog and do all this kind of stuff. So I threw on the water, the cold water, and it started going And it sounded like popcorn. And I don't know why, but I went like this and ducked. You guys, seriously, you wanna see the truth of the nature all day long? Look. There are, we cannot get those off. I got everything else in the kitchen. Look at this. We cannot get this off. So I'm gonna have to hire somebody now to come and get this off of our uh, thing because it was all over the floor. It was all over everywhere. I could have burnt my face off, which thankfully I didn't, but I could have burnt my face off and everything. And I'm like, oh my God, I cannot believe this. So anyway. I'm much better. This is why people are always like, you should cook stuff. You should do this. No, I really shouldn't. I'm nobody's cook. But I will tell you what I can do. I can heat up some leftovers like nobody's business. So anyway, um, I hope you guys enjoyed that. Let me know what you guys had. What was your favorite for Thanksgiving? If you had anything, what's your favorite leftovers? Oh my God, this macaroni and cheese looks so good. This is the best macaroni and cheese. I have to tell you, true story. I was skeptical about these mashed potatoes that Alex got from Costco, and they were literally like the best mashed potatoes in the entire world. Oh my god, they're perfect. This macaroni and cheese is so good. The stuffing, Peter's special stuffing, is awfully dry. <laughs> it's awfully dry. Anyway. Let me know what you guys uh, have for Thanksgiving, or do you like leftovers, and put it in the comment section below. And I will be back well, I don't know. Maybe a couple days. Love you guys. Bye.